Hi, today I'm here with Brad East from Wise Buy Investment Group. He is a broker to the stars, or to property investors, or whoever he comes across. But first, first time, first time as well. everyone. So, um, Brad, we wanted to get you in just to have a chat, um, specifically to our investor clients. Um, what, what sort of deals are, are out there in the marketplace at the moment for investors? Oh, look, it's no secret that. APRA, the government, has put the brakes on investment lending. They needed to slow down the market. It was out of control. You look at Sydney, you know, this time last year, the average increase was about $5,000 a week just for a property. Yeah. So, obviously, with the growth, they needed to slow that down. Easiest target was investors. Yeah. Um, so, what they do is they up the rate. So, the average interest rate for an interest-only investment loan is sitting around 5.5%. Right. That's for your big four. So, the big four actually had the most improvements to make. So obviously they they raised their rates higher than some of the smallers. Um, there are some second tier lenders out there that are still sitting around four and a half. Yep. I think I looked this morning, there was one at 4.39. Right. So it's not all that bad. Yep. Um, it is you know, made out in the media, it's all doom and gloom, but there is still options out there. Um, I guess we'll talk a little bit later about some of the other restrictions that they've put on that. So yep. the interest rate, in my opinion, is probably the the least of the worries. Right. Um, I think uh, some of the other restrictions they've put in the, in place will hurt a little bit more. Yeah. And what um, what sort of percentage difference are we paying for principal compared to interest only at the it's moment? A, look, it's about one percent. Right. Yeah. Well, thereabouts. So, with the big four, you'll pay about four and a half for a principal and interest uh, investment loan. Yeah. If you go interest only, it's about five and a half percent. Yeah. Okay. But as we discussed earlier on today, it still is an advantage to go interest only due to you're not paying a, a non-tax deductible portion. Exactly. Um, you know, on a five hundred thousand dollar loan, it's around fifteen grand a year. Yeah. So it makes sense to wear that extra percentage, yep. which is a tax deductible uh, um, expense anyway. Yeah. Awesome.